Hey guys! Your boy from Sheriff GD vlog and stuff as usual for YouTube, but he didn't complete it too. He said I should play around the things. I started with the team. I posted it too. Enjoy, but just know that there will be some groupers based on the fact that he didn't complete it. It's too chill though. Hi guys, so you know I said I wanted to go out my bath. I went downstairs, I started playing music and I slept off from there. Not really slept off, you know? I just had a short nap. Then what happened? My music died, so my music left my phone died. My phone was on like two percent so I put it on airplane when I was playing music and when the phone died, music stopped, I woke up and I realized that to be honest, I'm not going to have my beats. Because I I just I don't know, I think I feel more comfortable taking my beats in the night. Boy takes his break very late, but that doesn't stop him from looking this nice and great. I was trying to rhyme but I did not get it sure. But I don't see the need to bath when I'm not coming out. I know it's a dirty habit, but then that's me. So since I knew myself, I told myself, man, I better go and shoot this video so I don't lose on two sides. And I have rules, I have strategies, I have methodologies that I know I can employ if I want to literally get myself to beat, right? Like, I have these three good rules, right? Strategies. But then I did not use any of those strategies. That's another talk of another day. Captain Marvel, delivered by the top woman herself. So, what do I think about in this video, right? Um, I want to talk about the fact that if you really know me, you would know that I struggle with this, right? Um, I inspire people a lot. It is beautiful. I get the most wonderful messages ever, right? And it feels really nice to inspire people. But sometimes I ask myself, am I inspiring people and not inspiring myself? Right? Like, I always sometimes question myself, like, I'm inspiring people to achieve their goals, right? So I'm helping people achieve their goals. The question is, am I achieving my goals? I always ask myself this a lot. And I don't know. And the only way for me to know is to actually audit myself. That's what I'm doing in this video. Okay, so um, listen to me and let's see. I have three goals in life where I want to be a badass entrepreneur, two, to be a badass inspirational speaker, and three, to play around with the space of entertainment. Right? So, what I mean by be a badass entrepreneur is that's why I'm even in school. I don't like school like that, like that, like that. In fact, that for exams coming soon, and it's crazy. Routine. So she literally caught me 
And instead of scolding or beating me, she gave me money to stop my Richuko business. I bought Richuko and I was doing it for Papa. Papa. And I was making a ton of money from selling that, and our teacher eventually caught us. Apparently, to the legal selling school. That was a fact check. And for this series, it's crazy, it's actually crazy. So, I might want to be very good at entrepreneurship, but in recent days, I've been really scared. What do I mean by that? I got plans, I got plans, I got plans for life, and life is bigger than school. So, keep your head in the game. I can never remember where I stopped, right? Yeah, so that's one of the reasons why I go to school because I want to understand that part of business shit. Like, I really want to get my business up together. Because recently I've been scared, right? I know let people's opinions get to me, right? Like, in second school, I'm not a lot of money to sell it, right? Like, my mommy will give me pocket money, right? And I will go what I do with it, right? They would give me pocket money and instead of me taking me to school, like the day before I go to school, I used to go to the body and I was King's College Vegas, right? So um, I would go and buy pink pop. Pink pop is a sweet, right? I would buy like packets of them. I use all my pocket money to buy that. Uh, I'll keep like maybe 500. I would go to school, right? And I would sell pink pop. Pink pop was 20 naira at that time, right? That was the amount local retailers outside school were selling it. You feel me? And Imagine if they were selling it for 20 years, that means they were making some profit somewhere, right? I mean, I'll take it to school and I'll sell it at 15 years, because guess what? Nobody was selling it in school, right? And the thing about KC that time is, it's just like when you want to buy Pepsi now, and they're telling you to buy for 120, it doesn't make sense to you, right? You want to buy it on the dinner. So, in KC, nobody has 20 years, nobody has 10 years. When you buy a starting from 15 years, when you want to sell, sell two for 15 years, not like that. So, um, I started selling things for about 15 years. Right? And I made a lot of money, that's like over 150% profit. So, I used to make money from that a lot. That's what I'm saying, like, when I was smaller, when I did not care about people's opinions and points of view of me, I made a lot of money like in my business craft. But recently, I've been careful. Among schedule. When I say careful, I've been start I've been fucked up sure. Like right now I cannot even start a business because I'm always thinking that now I have to start advertising. I, I, I don't know. I don't know. But I want to figure it out. And I thought that was what school was supposed to let me do, but now nah, school they want to just chill on me, right? So going forward I will try to look for some business ideas and really work on it and really invest myself into it. So that is where I am in the entrepreneurship space. So yes, I'm inspiring people, but I've not sorted my entrepreneurship life out yet. And I need to sort that part out. I'll probably start the OD brand. I've been thinking about that a lot. For going to get designers and stuff. But that's not like people's business, right? Um, what's the second thing? Inspiration. Yes. I'm having a great time with inspiration now. Um, is it guys not getting told? Like, I can mention 30 things straight up right now that is enough to make you happy. Are you alive? Yes. Did you eat food this morning? Probably. Yes. Are you wearing clothes? Probably. Yes. You have a phone to post this comment on TikTok. That's enough, right? Um, are you trying to achieve your goals? Yes. Do you believe that you're correct to go sometimes? Yes. I have about 29,000 followers on TikTok right now. Every single day I keep getting a lot of messages, requests, emails to uh, WhatsApp. So they, they, they take my number. I know where they take it from, but no one's done, you should not figure it out. But then, people calling, texting, chatting, whatever, telling me how uh, I've inspired them, how uh, I stopped them from committing suicide, how uh, I made them start doing some things, how uh, I'm always in their head, and then once they impact them, how uh, I. It's been mad, it's been cute. I'm coming! I am coming! I think I'm achieving that. So that is a goal I want to achieve. Like the reason I make videos, I believe, is um I want to at least get one person, just one person, to send me a DM 
any day talking about how I've inspired them and that's enough for me, right? Not really I don't have like 10 million followers. Too. But like that is the goal, that's my goal. If I get one message every day, I'm okay with that. I'm getting a lot of messages like that. So I think it's very fine and safe to say I achieved that goal. Even though it's time to like my problem of fighting, me thinking that I'm inspiring people. You get the gist. What's the last one? Entertainment, right? Entertainment, I break it down into three. I call it fashion, acting, and modeling. What I mean by fashion is. Okay? What I mean by fashion is. I, I kind of like the fashion space. You would have look crazy about clothes and stuff like that. You will never see me using my own tobacco for myself. It's a classic. I just, can't. I just don't. It just won't happen. What I mean by that is. Um, I believe in entertainment, educational entertainment, merging it to that to get that, right? Like, I played, let me tell you something, I played basketball in junior secondary school, yeah? I played for my hours, I think I played ball match. I was short, but then I still played, right? But what made me get interested in basketball was because of I watch high school music. I don't do it for a child. I used to pop those basketball, that don't make me love it, right? Um, chess. Queen of Cats, I watch Queen of Cats where uh, I fell in love with chess and I won a lot of competitions, chess competitions in secondary school just because I fell in love with the movie that represented that, right? So I really believe in entertainment, passing an important message, you know, you know that's me, you know I have a lot of important messages, passing an important message is in an entertaining way, right? Because that's what make people want to listen to that message. So um, I feel like I feel like entertainment is the way people keep passing my message. That's why I'm, I have FA and fashion acting and modeling, right? I have played a little bit around acting, right? Because I believe like movies. Like I told you, I like about chess for movies, right? So on Sunday, be in my own movie. On Sunday, I'm a blockbuster movie. On Sunday, make a proper movie in Netflix ish. That talks about the kind of things I want to pass about. So I played around with acting. I don't know if I'm very good at it, but I played at it, right? Modeling. Um, people say I'm cute, so I do not want to waste. I do not want to waste all of this cuteness away like that. So I'll play around with modeling. So I have a good idea. Comment. I've played around with it a little bit. Um, what's the last one? Fashion. Yeah. So. To be honest, I don't know if I'm really going towards my goals, but then I think there are some outside goals I have that I've been working towards, right? Like, for a long time, I always believed that the Nigerian educational system doesn't suit me, that I should be studying abroad. I know I got a scholarship, $20,000 scholarship to study in South Africa when I was in secondary school, because I won a spelling bee competition, but I did not go to the school. You think I'm crazy, but I did it. But then, that's one goal I'm working on too, right? I have some other goals too. But it's crazy. I don't want to be an hypocrite. I don't want to be that guy that inspires people to achieve their goals and does achieve my own goal. He said I'm going serious. He said I'm going serious. Right. Like one goal I've always had is to always wake up at 5 a.m. for like six months. And I'm not still actually it till now. So it's crazy actually. <sighs> Which other go? Like, I also want to tell my crushes the ones I like, I want to tell them that I like them. So I'm not cool. If I guess one of my friends, Felimi, or my friends from Instagram, right? Uh, I came up with a list. Maybe I'll share the list. Yeah, I think I should share the list. I'm coming back and we're going to do the list. Ah. Oh.